Hi. Going? You want, you want up up? Do you want up up? Hi. You want to use me to clean off? Hi, handsome. Hey guys, I'm going to go ahead and make my cold brew coffee. Apparently cold brew coffee has less acidity. I don't know any other benefit besides less acidity, but I know it helps me. So what I do is I, I get about three quarters of a scoop of some dark roast coffee. Then I add some Brita water. filling up and overfilling your water. I like to give it a little bit of a mix inside of its container. Got this um, cold brew steeping piece off of Amazon. And then it sits on the counter for about 24 to 48 hours and then I stick it in the fridge. That's all it takes to make cold brew coffee at home. Pervicacity? Pervicacity. There you go. Pervicacity. Pervicacity. <laughs> Pervicacity. All right. Now it's. Wait, 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 wait. What do we think it means? Um. um what do you think it means? Just guess. I want to see it really bad. No, well, no, the no. first definition's ultimately not the most helpful definition. The first definition is the quality or state of being pervicacious. Okay. <laughs> it's of Latin origin from the early 17th century. They say the part of speech is a noun, but to me it's a descriptor. So, so like an to me it's more of an adjective. So... Like acidity or... That's, That's right. You're right. It's very, not a person, place, or a very good. Oh my goodness, Shh. you're anyway. so smart. <laughs> All right. So the second is much better. It's obstinacy, stubbornness, willfulness. A character trait. A character trait. So, one more time. The word. The buzzword. Pervicacity. Charlie. Pervicacity. Pervicacity. And there is our pervicacity buzzword of the week. Mango likes spinach. No. <laughs> you have your own spinach. She wants that spinach so bad. She's willing to risk life and limb to get to it. Don't, girls, don't fight. That's the last thing Mango wants is fighting. You have your own spinach. Stop, Mango. Come on, baby girl. Girls, you need to get off of her cage. You have your own spinach. They have their... Oh, they've been eating off their spinach. You have plenty of spinach. Come on. 
Come on, don't. <laughs> Girls. Listen, I don't want anyone's talons to be chomped on. Mango, let me help you out here, love. And put that all the way back in. You just, you keep your own spinach. Hey, Kiwi. Kiwi girl. <laughs> Come eat your own spinach, love. You don't need her spinach. You got your own. <laughs> Girls. Oh, my goodness. All right, so we went to our local store called Ancient Awakenings. Are they a franchise? No, they're not. They're a privately mm. owned and run. Thanks for you guys. I love Ancient Awakenings. We get we got water kefir. Um, we got these fermented vegetables. Can you so what I've yeah. done, just I've junkified it. I've put sour cream sandwiches over it so that you taste mostly that. But fermented vegetables have a lot of health benefits. We also bought some of that from Ancient Awakenings. We're about to taste as well. All right, so both of them. Now Charlie has some gut issues and needs to needs to go ahead and get some good probiotic and prebiotics, and not the stuff that you buy that's processed at a store. We've even made our own fermented veggies. They've never been anything decent, and I might have gotten mold once because it's a little bit of a you have to do it just the right way. So mm -hmm. I wasn't sure, and we didn't eat them. Well, these are professionals, so I'm go positive for it. they didn't put it the whole thing in your mouth. The whole thing. I mean, it honestly smells good. It, well, it's sour cream, it but sour. the flavor when you get the the fermented vegetables, it's like crunchy. It's really nice. It was. Ready? Mm -hmm. Did you like yours? No. no. Ready? No. Okay, no. Ooh, can ooh, you do me a favor and, and not be dramatic and just trust that I'm not making you do anything crazy? Charlie, give it a second. Work on the sour cream. Taste the sour cream. <laughs> not tasting the sour cream. Ch Shana, you do it. I'm, I promise you, yes. it was not horrific. It was not by prison it really, I kind of liked it when I was done. I was like, I could do another spoonful of that. Another shot? Sour. I'm not that big a fan of sour cream. All right. It's just yeah. too much. Now let's do the banana vanilla coconut kefir. <laughs> so they do use regular, do you want to try this one, Charlie? Sure. They do use regular um, milk kefir grains and they use uh, coconut milk, I guess. About this is coconut milk, living milk kefir grains, bananas, raw blue agave, pure vanilla extract, stevia extract, and billions of live and active probiotic cultures. So, I guess the majority of this is all organic. However, the most important thing to know is that when you get milk kefir, like at a regular grocery store. It's, it's not overly processed, it's and processed so and it kills all the good benefits that this is going to give you. So we're going to use our oh handy dandy gosh. special spoons. Oops. This is beautiful. Okay, and it's a nice creamy oh texture. Gosh. It's beautiful. Here you go. I have never tasted this one because I generally don't like banana flavored things. Um, however, because we have to reawaken our milk and water kefir grains today we're going to go ahead and do this because charlie needs to get started on some gut health and i who can't benefit from that because your gut health is where your immunity comes from let's do it what do you think sour it is sour it's um it's sour but it's i definitely doable definitely doable can you mix it with other things sure I can put that in the smoothie. All right, so we have re woken up. They're woke. We've got woke kefir greens. <laughs> We didn't know if our kefir grains would wake up, but we went to Ancient Awakenings and asked them and they suggested we use the pet milk because that's the best to probably feed your grains. So in here, we have got some whey at the bottom. 
we have some cultured milk, which turns into kefir, milk kefir. And then we have the kefir grains. So when we use anything, any utensils, we never use metal on our grains. Out, and I'm going to second ferment it. I'm going to put in, we actually have watermelon, but I think I'm going to put orange in. Haven't we done Ooh, orange? Oh, orange is really good. Yep, orange will be yes, really I good. I like the orange flavored ones. She I seems don't. impassioned about the orange. Did we ever try, I think we, we tried, tried strawberry. strawberry. I don't mm -hmm. remember if I like that one, but we did orange. Whoa, is that the way? So that way I have used when making um, just pancakes or something else. Um, I've also taken the whey out if it's because that's really very well done. I don't always get it to the point where it's going to get whey. However, if I get it at that point, a lot of times I'll get rid of the whey and put it through a cheesecloth and then I'm stuck with this or left with a very thick creamy uh, milk kefir and at that point I'll throw a couple of drops of stevia and a couple of drops of some good vanilla, and it's like a vanilla like smoothie. That is my favorite. That is really good. Yeah, that's how I always had it. Um, I would, I want to say shades. That's where you started your smoothie makings. From, uh, you made smoothies. But yeah, probably. Yeah. Yeah. I love smoothies from years and years ago. Okay, so I'm actually gonna get. Oh, it's so good. I'm gonna get rid of this way. I'm going to start the next one in a much larger jar. So I initially started out with less kefir grains than this, and they just keep multiplying every single day. Now these have been really well fed. So I'm going to use this, what they call pit milk, and it's called pit milk because it's not been processed in any way. It comes straight from the cow into the bottle. Wow. Um, I've also purchased another form of milk from um, Ancient Awakenings that is not, it's either pasteurized, it's pasteurized, it's pasteurized. Non homogenized yeah. that I will be doing. So this needs to sit out, let it breathe because it's an aerobic So you're going to keep that next to the hot? I'm going to put it by the ice maker. The ice maker has a fan that blows hot and that will warm this up and it's not like at this point you, you can't barely feel it but that will help so oh, a yeah. lot of um probiotics but you also need prebiotics so like if i were to put banana in here that's a prebiotic and then this would be needs to eat away at the sugar yeah and this also <laughs> becomes kind of a fizzy drink Really? Mm hmm. It's got a slight fizz. Nothing like kombucha or water. Or water keeper. keeper. Water keeper is really good. Yeah. What happens? Uh, this was m the most challenging one I thought to really wake up. So Ow. we will try this tomorrow. Here we go. I'm gonna go ahead and put this in the fridge. Give it a good mix, and this will thicken up and also start to separate. If you leave it in too long, it does start to taste really sour. All right, let's put it in the fridge. from tennis that is why I'm a mess and we just saw that we have two packages and one might just went out one is a terabyte and one is a special gift that we're about to find out all right so mom is very secretive about this I'm trying to grab my phone from my bag and I can't find it mom is really secretive about this weird surprise gift thing I can't find my phone oh I found it okay so, she says she has to put batteries in it. And the only thing, since we share um, an Amazon account, the only thing that I know, or Amazon, yeah, Amazon account, the only thing I know is that it's yellow and it's rectangular. 
and I'm really scared because she said she has to put batteries in it and I know mom can have some really great prank ideas. So, I don't know. We'll see how this goes today. All right. Okay. Should I open it? Yeah. Okay. Oh, good. A box. Hi, Bella. A box in a box. This is a present I got for everyone. Oh, gosh. Mm -hmm. I just push it? Well, you pushed it away from me. You don't push it away from me. Do I push that? Do it close to you. No! Come on. No! Do what it says. <laughs> uh, this is Can you get in the shot, please? No, I'm scared. All right. Dad didn't scream. Could you get close? I can't. You're not in the shot. I'm not even kidding you. You'll have to edit yourself in <laughs> if you. Okay. Push it forward. Oh, forward. Okay. Do it again. Turn it on. Turn it on? Yeah, like push it forward. I did. It's called a useless box. All it does is you push the button and it turns it off. Oh my gosh. That's amazing. <laughs> oh, that was really scary. Wait, how do you open this though? What does this do? It's a useless box. There's nothing in it but the batteries <gasps> and the motor. That was really scary. Okay, you want to get Charlie up here? Okay, That's seriously. Alone. That's funny. You want to get Charlie up here? Yeah. Okay. We got a present. Yeah, we got a present. Come here. Put it in the box. Make it appear to be a real gift. Come on. Hey, Charlie. We got a gift. You you want to open it? It's gonna be. It's gonna be pretty now. You gotta push the top. Frickin' brain that doesn't stop know, working. Hi, It's a useless box. Close it. Close it. Close it. Hi, Bella. You don't want to break it. Close it. And all you do is you push it on and it turns itself off. It's, it's a useless box. This is like a stress toy. Does it cause stress? Stress, stress, stress oh. relieving. Stress relieving. Okay, well, good times. That was not as exciting as I thought.
keyboard was still... That's what that box was. <laughs> Forgot I left the box up there. I, I was like, yes. I worked so hard on that spear. Oh, jeez. Like, really hard. And then so much went into that thoughtfulness. Sorry. I set my alarm for 6.30 this morning. <laughs> this is a put on a bunny thing. I wanted to scare you. It didn't even scare you that good. Well, then you know there's more coming. <laughs> okay, here's the thing. Oh, oh, so scared. Hold on. Hold on. I actually had other plans. I had all sorts of plans. And I thought, you know what? If you're holding a bird, I don't want you to injure a bird. No, pervicacity. Uh, pervicacity. 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 So, Charlie, um, we have, we're gonna. Hmm. What's it do? What if you guys say it? Pervicacity. No. Buzz word of the week. Buzz word of the week. Word of no. the week. That's not the. I think oh. a dog is throwing up. Dad's walking upstairs. Mmm. It sounds eerily like a dog vomiting. Hey! Or a cat having a hairball. What is everybody Charlie? doing? Charlie? Anything else? Kind of like a sourdough. What are he you was, giggling? He was like <laughs> pecking at my hand. Okay. I'm sorry. He's going to Excuse me. You could. You could choke. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, the reason I'm choking is because I've just been with a bunch of dust. Um, is that funny for you? Uh, this will be delicious. I need oh help. Oh my gosh, he's eating me. Ow! <laughs> Hang on. Actually, if I leave this in the fridge. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, are you guys ready for. No, third time. No, I'm not ready. Okay. I'm ready. Look, I got my stuff out. Are you ready for. You know how to pronounce this stuff? Buzzwords? Buzzwords. Words. Words. Okay. Buzzwords. Don't okay. okay. Seriously. I don't know, Charlie. What is Budsworth? Budsworth is an imaginary word I created. Fabulous. Are we ready for buzzwords? Worth? Yeah. No. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't pause it. Okay. We... Like Can you guys get together? Because it's really hard to get the two of you. Wait, get, just. Just get stage together. Left or stage, yeah, stage Enter stage left, Charlie. Perfect. Oh my gosh. Alright, are you ready? Yeah. Here is the... Don't. Come, just say it. <laughs> what do you think it means? <laughs> you gasped? <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, I really understand. I didn't mean that. <laughs> Take two. Go ahead. Buzzword of the week. Buzzword of the week, everybody. One more time, Charlie? No. no. In slow motion. No. Yeah. Please, one more time. You can one more make time. That slow -mo and I movie. Please, tr please try that for me. I'm sorry. Are wheels mating in the kitchen again? <laughs> no, no. Do it. Do it for real. I'll put it as the backdrop here. Go ahead. Do it for real. Me going in the background as buzzword of the week comes. I'll just detach that audio. Come on, let's try it, Charlie. You do do something cool. No, 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 no. <laughs> Sounds no, so much like dad. End. No, 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 no. Buzzword of the week, Charlie. Do it. The buzzword of the week, everybody. 
you welcome to the show, Charlie and Santa, who are obviously sister and brother. And welcome to my mom, who's going to be the host. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. I didn't mean that. All right, can you do buzzword of the week? Buzzword of the week, everybody. <laughs> Where did you get it? Where is it? <laughs> No ad living here, okay? Buzzword of the week. Go. Yeah. Buzzword of the week, everybody. No, no, everybody. everybody. Buzzword of the week. Go. Buzzword of the week. Done. Done. That's good. If you hadn't said done, it would have been perfect. I needed a pause. Go, go ahead, Charlie. Buzzword of the week. Your tongue tripped on itself. <laughs> Try that again. Buzzword of the week, everybody. No, 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 everybody. Okay. <laughs> Buzz week. Buzz <laughs> word of the week, Charlie. Buzz. That's all I got. Buzz. Buzz word. Okay, how about if you say buzz word of the, and then Shana says week. Okay. Buzz word of the week. No. What? Shana says Buzz word of the. Buzz word of the. Oh my god. This is a mess. Alright, just. You just say buzz. Just say buzzword. Buzzword. <laughs> ah, now it feels like of the week should be, should be in there. Oh yeah. Alright, try it again. Buzzword of the. Week. No, it's yours. Oh. Week! <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Buzz word of the week, everybody. No, no, everybody. <laughs> Just buzz How about it's time for buzz word of the week, everybody? That would work there. It is time for the buzz word of the week, everybody. <laughs> try, try, try. <laughs> try it again. It's time for the buzz week of the week, everybody. <laughs> Buzzword. Okay, no, buzzword. Buzzword. Get rid of everybody. It's time for buzzword of the week. Here, say it's time for like regular, and then do however you say. It's time. No, no, we like the other way. It's time for buzzword of the week, everybody. No, no, everybody. That was kind of good. You just had to talk over no, it. Everybody. I like the everybody. What? Keep. He's making it a full sentence. Go ahead, Charlie. It is Buzz Word of the Week, everybody. The birds. I didn't like that one. Go ahead, try again. It's Buzz. Brad, Brad, stop it! It's the birds. Okay, go. I think I'm exciting them. <laughs> He's exciting them. <laughs> They're exciting them. Oh, okay. It's upsetting them. I'm exciting them. All right, and wait, wait for a pause. It's Buzz. No. <laughs> It's past where it is time for <laughs> it is time for buzz word of the week, everybody. Voice is really creepy. All right, Charlie, one more time. You got this. Nail it. It is time for no. It's it, it's time for buzz word of the week, everybody. I think, I'm seeing it, everybody. I think that was perfect. But you know what? I think I'm going to go in a different direction. <laughs> hey guys, we hope you like that video. Please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell.